$12. So I have some stuff from Amazon.com that you guys can pick up. Um, so this is all stuff that my husband got me off of Amazon.com for Christmas um, and birthday because my birthday is in this month. Anyway, already happened. So, happy belated birthday to me. To you. To me. Alright, so this is a bag. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Turn to a girl. It has a wonderful thing on the back that says, please don't use this as any type of device because you could suffocate with it. Blah, blah, blah. That's pretty funny. Alright. So here's a bag. I love the colors on it. It's very bright. It's like a... Yeah, it's really like a, heavy duty sticker patch yeah. thing. Yeah, and it, it really sticks nice. off. So hopefully that will not fall off. Handle on the back so you can carry it. There's a pocket in the back. Pocket up front. Pocket. It's really cool. Never have too many pockets. Velcro. See through pocket there. Velcro. More stuff in there. Alright. Your hand your strap here to go over your shoulder. Two pockets right there. They're separated as you can see. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. Alright. And then there is a pocket where you could put like a very small laptop or a tablet. I would say probably a tablet. iPad. Yeah. Um iPad, Galaxy, whatever those things are called. Mm -hmm. Um and then there's a pocket on the side here. You can see that. Cell phone, water. Yeah. Cell phone, water. Sounds perfect to me. But they got plenty of pockets on this beast. It'd be good if you didn't have but little books to tote around with you. So, um, the Pit Boy bag is, would you say, almost a fourth of the size bigger than this one? Yeah. And um, yeah. It, it definitely snugly fits a 15-inch laptop in that bag. And it's very well padded. This one's padded pretty good, too. The other one's got a flap on it. This is awesome. This didn't cost that much. Um, I'm not sure the exact cost because I didn't buy it. But um, I think it was anywhere from $35 to $50. So, in comparison to $78, that's a little bit cheaper. So, if you just need something for a tablet, pick this up. Plenty of pockets. All right. So, this is actually a backpack. So, like I said, this is all Amazon. But if you go over to Think Geek, they also have this. So this is one of the things that's from overseas. It's got that BSW there, like I've shown you on the other stuff. So anyway, so it's got these straps are actually really nice. See, look, they're they're thin. And they're almost like they're I thought that they, or something. yeah, I thought that they would be um, fake. It's not real leather. Um, I thought that it would be hard just by looking at it. So this is a very bright color blue. I like the colors of it. It's got the 111. It'd be great for going to the gym with. So, big huge pocket here to st shove stuff. Cool. It's got a sensor so you can cinch it down. So, like if you're going to the beach or something. <clears throat> so, Good huge deep book bag here. Like we're looking at got it's pencils. Yeah. Or something. yeah. And it expands out. See, as you can see down here. It expands out. So this would be perfect for school. Um, <laughs> Going to Costco and getting your food. Yeah. Or sharp sharp. <laughs> they don't have post people don't have sharp sharpers. <laughs> um, probably don't have Costco's either. <laughs> anyway, so these are pencil pockets, regular little pocket, another little pocket to put things, see-through pocket. This right here is Velcro strap. Deeper down in there is padded slightly, so you could put like a tablet or a laptop. I bet you, like an Air, one of those little. I fit in. No, little um, notebooks would probably fit in there. The Mac notebooks. Oh, okay. A lot of people get those. They're like 13 inches. I bet you those will fit down in there. But the width is what I'm worried about, and I'm pretty sure that that would not hold a very big laptop because I'm thinking about our laptops, and that would not hold that up. You could stick it down in here, but as far as the padding part, no. But it's only slightly padded. So, but it'd be very hard for somebody to sneak and take all your stuff out without you knowing because there's like four different ways they have to get in here. So that's kind of cool. And it's got slightly padded straps. Not quite padded as the uh, Pip-Boy okay. bag. 
It's very well sewn. This is like yeah, really it's awesome. very well made, and then it's got a handle so you can carry it. It's like super heavy duty. Yeah, and the canvas is thick. I mean, this is like what you expect from Fallout, you know, because this stuff. Yeah, it's not. It's not made cheap. It's made yeah, nice. It's like made we have nice. cheap bags. That's not a cheap bag. Um, it's not like what you get your kids for school. All right, now on to some other stuff. So they sell pants on there. They have a whole bunch of them. <laughs> Yeah. What kind These, of pants, Tiffany? Bedtime pants. Bedtime pants. There's a blizzard going on here right now, and we're in our bedtime pants filming things for you guys. <laughs> anyway, so here's one that we got here. And these are really from Bethesda. They're not from overseas. They say Bethesda. Anyway. That's where the butt goes. Yeah, that's where the butt goes. And they touch the butt. Mm -hmm. All right, so you guys can see these right here. And these are also officially licensed Bethesda. Bethesda. Oh, yeah, it's real. It's Why real. they don't sell them on Bethsoft, I'm not 100% sure. But, you know, tomato, tomato, man. Where'd you get them from? Amazon. You bought them for me, babe. I know. All right. Like I said, don't know the prices on these. Just go in there and type out Fallout. So there they are. Pretty, pretty freaking sweet. Fallout. <laughs> GameStop did have some bought 111 dark blue ones. They're on sale or were on sale for 10 bucks. So you can always hit that up. All right. So here is another t shirt. Fallout. This, it's got some hair on it from the dog. So it says Fallout. At first, I thought this was a fake t shirt, but then I went into FYE and they also sell it. And it's a different, different color there. And this is 100% cotton, so that means no drying. As per usual. As per usual, people need to know. Inquiring minds. Another bio world, which means this is from overseas. I don't have to get into this somehow. It's a t-shirt, right? It is a t-shirt. They make three different ones of these. All different poses. Hey. Yeah, I like this one. I really want a t-shirt of the critical. I wish that they would do one of that. So these all come like blue on blue background, which is kind of um, weird, but I kind of like them. So I ordered one because at first I didn't like it. And the more I saw it, the more I wanted one. Um, and then of course this is Bethesda there. And then it says under license to level up wear. And then on the back it says Fallout 4. But they make three different ones of these. So you can go on Amazon.com and look for them. And they're officially licensed. So you guys know the difference. I like some of the unlicensed ones though as well. So we buy all sorts of them. <laughs> but anyway, try to do just the official stuff here. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. If you have any questions, let me know. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment.